Breaking news overnight, dozens of cars flooded in all that heavy rain. Our team coverage continues with our crews out in Cobb County. We begin with Trace and Bragg. Trace, and what are you seeing where you are? Well, I'll tell you, take a look at where I'm standing, Rob. I'm on Columns Drive, about a mile up from the intersection with Johnson's Ferry Road. And take a look, I'm in near knee-high water. And this is as close as I'm willing to go to that vehicle because this is as this is the safest spot, I'd say, in this water. Take a look, that water is even deeper there. It has that car completely stuck and surrounded in that water. And if you take a close look, you can see the water level has actually dropped about six inches from the time that car was originally stuck in this water. And if you look just past that, you see driveways flooded and firefighters. I'll tell you, they're a big part of the reason why we were able to actually get in here. I actually just fell in this water a little bit here because it's so deep, but we actually found ourselves at a barricade here. We weren't able to make our way through until a host of fire trucks started making their way through. They allowed us to come in a little bit closer so we could actually see this. They came in to make sure everyone in this neighborhood was safe. Luckily, we haven't gotten any, any reports of anyone injured. Again, this water is very deep. I just actually fell in, and I'll tell you, this water, it reached almost to my knee, and this is not even close to where that vehicle is. So, Rodney, you said it just a minute ago, Anyone out on the roads, do not try to drive down this section of Columns Drive or walk down this area. Firefighters aren't letting you down here. Please stay safe as we continue to report here in Marietta. I'm Tracy Bragg, CBS 46 News.